Hello, my name is Craig Basher. I'm an application engineer for Advanced Solutions. There always comes a time where I want to share data with manufacturing. As an engineer, I use a product like Inventor to create my designs. and I have to share my files. And I don't share my engineering files. I usually share them a, a file that's like a read-only file, like PDF or DWF. Now, to share a 3D file to manufacturing, uh, I can share that as a PDF, but I would have to go out and purchase a software called Adobe XPro. And there's a high cost involved with that. If I use the export PDF function right out of Inventor for this particular file, um, it creates a 2D steel, steel object like PDF or like a JPEG or a bitmap image. Uh, it really doesn't help the manufacturing team. So to share that 3D solid, I want to export out as a DWF file. And that is a, a lightweight file that's read-only. And it allows me to give them that 3D solid. Now what I publish, I have options with Inventor to say what they can do with that file. Do I allow them to have markups or measure the file? Well, what kind of properties can they see? Now when I hit publish here, it's going to open up the actual DWF file inside of a software called Design Review. Design Review is a free software. Now with Inventor, when I install Inventor, the Design Review product is already installed with it. But to share this file with manufacturing, they must have Design Review too. Now, I can go out to the web, I can go out to Google and type in uh, Autodesk Design Review, hit enter, and I can pick on there, and it's a free download. Now, not only is it a free download, but it is also part of the Autodesk Cloud technology that I can put on an iPad or an iPhone, and then I can share uh, my files via the cloud and that DWF file. So if I go back to design review, you can see here that I have it open. I can rotate it. I can give the manufacturing the option to add notes to this file. So we can say what material. And you can also do measuring. That's kind of like a markup too. So I can pick on the front side and pick on the back side here. And it will give me the length. Okay, and once I have the made the markups, I can save this file. Now, I can send this file to manufacturing via email, and then they can open up and they would see the markups. They also can make their own markups as well. So let's do that. Let's just open it up. Let's go and say new. We're going to send this to Rick, and it's for review. And then we'll go and say attach the file. It's the DWF file, and we can send it off to him. Now, he can open that file up with Design Review himself. So let's do that. Let's act like we're Rick here. Let's go over here and see I have that Design Review file here. I can just double click on it. It will open up the file in Design Review once it's installed on his computer, and he'll be able to see those same markups. So if you have any other questions, just contact us here at Advanced Solutions and we'll help you further with your uh, design review questions.